Go, now man. Clint takes off. Oh, that's a familiar direction. He's rounding the freezer, passing the fresh veggies, and he finds the meat department right where it's always been. He's going for hams. Always a good money move. With seconds left to go, Lulu's doing hams at high speed. She just never lets up. Randy's still hanging in there as she backs her cart up to the meat department, and she takes her turn at the ham section. Jessica is working the imported cheese and ham ham. Meanwhile, Becky's hoisting huge hams into her cart, while Jan is headed for the meat department and starts hauling in hams. Brooke's mom is giving her daughter a lot of support, and Brooke is making it count. Next stop, our gold-wrapped Farmer John hams. Smart shopping, but check out Team 3. Run is getting ham as the seconds keep ticking by. Now Kevin's just about got it, there. And he's at the meat and poultry section going for gold-wrapped Farmer John hams. And Debbie knows our Farmer John hams are a great choice. She heads right for the gourmet hams. <laughs> and the cameraman gets out of the way. Let's see what she wants now. Oh, that's smart. Our big Farmer John hams. But what about Adam? I'm talking about those gourmet hams he's adding. And Frances starts filling her fresh cart with a mountain of gold-wrapped Farmer John hams. Those gold foil-wrapped hams are from Farmer John. They're heavy, but you wouldn't know it from the way she's pitching them in. Look at Mary's cart. Can you imagine a fuller one? There are only seconds left to go now as the audience counts down. And this sweep is coming to an end. No more time, Laura. We're gonna find out who has the highest total back here. That's the team that gets to go for $5,000 in ham.